Hey, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the Amazon Fire Stick. The new Amazon Fire TV Stick with Alexa Voice Remote. So we're going to go ahead and open it up. As you can see, the standard Amazon box. Okay, and here is the Fire TV Stick box. Okay, we're going to go ahead and open it up. And then on the back, it's got some information saying you can watch over 5,000 channels, apps, and games. There's always something on. Enjoy content from Netflix, YouTube, NBC, HBO, Fox, ESPN. Say goodbye to buffering from the Fire Stick TV. Okay, let's go ahead and open it up. And we'll go ahead and show you what's all in the package. Okay, this is what the lovely box looks like. Very nicely packaged. Okay, let's go ahead and open it up. Okay, and in the package you have your manual, your fire stick. This tells you about the remotes, the content that it has. Okay, and on the back of this, if you choose to get Sling, you get 20 plus channels for $20 a month. Here is your manual. It tells you everything that is included in this Fire Stick. And this one actually does come with an extender, not a very long one, but for those like myself don't like to plug it in the back of the TV you do have that extender as an option and as you can see here is the USB that you plug into the fire stick and into the outlet here is your standard 110 US um, USB plug outlet Okay, and here is your Alexa remote. Looks pretty much like the shield. Really nice, very light. Let's go ahead and unpackage it. Okay, as you can see, you have the voice command at the top. Very nice. Back here is where you put your batteries. Just go ahead and slide this down. You just insert your batteries here. The standard batteries are the Amazon batteries. Not really sure how good these are. We'll try them out and see actually how good they are. As you can see, these are the standard Amazon batteries. Okay, let's go ahead and take out the fire stick. As you can see, it's very thin, very light. Okay, let's go ahead and unpackage it. And as you can see, it says Amazon. Right here is your standard HDMI. Right here is where your USB plug for the power supply. Very light in the hand. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we'll set it up. And then we will come right back. But overall, this is a very nice design, very light, very nice looking. So we'll be right back as soon as we install it. Okay, now we got it installed into our TV. It's saying it's searching for our remote. We're going to go ahead and pair up our remote. Sorry for the quality. I'm taking this on my my webcam and it doesn't catch the bright lights on my TV. Okay, we're going to go ahead and set it up to US. 
Okay, it says unsupported US port, which is fine. We're just gonna go ahead and set it up. Now it's scanning for my network. I'll be back as soon as I input my uh, network. Okay, now it's connecting, checking for updates. Now it's downloading the software. It's gonna turn off the fire stick. It's gonna restart and you'll get the Amazon logo. Now it's installing the latest software. It says it can take up to 10 minutes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let this install. Now you'll get this Fire TV Stick logo. For those who don't have a significant power, I would suggest plugging it into your um, power plug. And right here, it's gonna tell you to go ahead and sign in with your account. So you're just gonna go ahead and sign in. And it's gonna ask you if you wanna save your Wi-Fi password to Amazon. You're gonna go ahead and click yes. And then it's gonna ask you if you want this kid friendly. I'm gonna put no, cause that's for me. Then it will take you with the online setup to show you all your movies and your options, which I'm going to go ahead and show you there. And right here, it will just show you all the content that you can get with other apps. But the purpose of getting this is to install APKs. So we're just going to go ahead and let this fast forward a bit. And then it's going to ask to install an app. We're going to go ahead and install Crackle. Okay, this is your home screen. As you can see, it's not very good quality because I'm recording from my um, webcam. But you have all these movies. I believe once you sign up, you will get a 30-day trial of the Amazon Prime. Um, I have done that, so I get all these movies and TV shows for free. For the first 30 days if you continue their service instead of being i think it was 7.99 or 10.99 it's now 12.99 to continue with amazon prime if you're like me like apks you will go ahead and download um es explorer um to get your content that will be another video so overall i'd say this uh Fire TV stick is pretty good. Um, I still use my Nvidia Shield for everyday tasks. This is just something to do a review on for all those who are on the Fire Stick. So overall, I would say a lot of you guys, this is a really nice uh, device. If it's something spare, like you go to the hotels or you go vacationing, this is something to pick up and take with you. So this has been the review of the Amazon Fire TV Stick.